music is back in downtown Sacramento after a few years of silence. And the best part, Tony, is that it's absolutely free. Hi, we're both luxury home specialists here in Sacramento that show you the lifestyle of all the cool things that are happening through our videos. So take a look. We started concerts in the park over a decade ago. We wanted to activate Cesar Chavez Plaza. We wanted to bring a way to have free music, lots of fun, all ages, bring in local vendors, support local musicians, and bring in more national bands. So we're really excited that it's officially come back and we're ready to keep going. Madeline Smith, Communications Manager, Downtown Sacramento Partnership. There is something for everyone at Concerts in the Park. We absolutely fill up the entire park. So first thing we do is kind of fence everything off to make sure that everything can be safe for the community, that everyone can enjoy without having to be worried about anything. Then we fill the park with local artists, uh, the local musicians kick us off. We have a wine garden. We have a beer bar sponsored by Bud Light. Um, we'll have cocktails. We'll have um, activities for families, all ages, and uh, live artists doing live art during the time. In, in addition to local artists and vendors selling what they have to offer. We're so excited after our first week and we have 11 more weeks going. The only week that we end up missing is the July first weekend because we really want people to be able to travel and enjoy and not miss anything. So we have amazing headliners coming in, national headliners including Bob Moses, Cannons, Will Dorado, uh, Slender Bodies, and Mod Sun closes us out uh, July 29th. So this goes all the way from last Friday through July 29th. It's 12 weeks and 11 more weeks to go. Luckily, Concerts in the Park doesn't stop at 9 p.m., so it runs every Friday from 5 to 9 p.m., but afterwards, we have a list of after-party locations that are actually helping to sponsor this free event for everybody, one being Maya Well and La Cassecha, which we're super excited to share the park with, and they offer drink specials. Just show your Bud Light wristband, and then you'll get drink specials all night. The after-party is just a really great celebration right here, right after the concert in the park. You know, you don't have to go very far. La Cosecha and Maya Weller are both sponsors for the official after party of the concert. So please make sure to keep your wristbands on. Come into La Cosecha and Maya Weller to enjoy all the great specials and benefits from coming here to the concert.